first. Uh, yeah. It's a bit awkward. We need the forest or an island and a bunch of lands that drop the land in the mall. Mmm. Alright, well. I got a mulligan. It's too bad because I think. Oh, well, that, that could be okay. I need a forest. I mean, I think that this should be a decent matchup. Maybe I'll have one of those inconsistent hands here. I don't want to see the 2 1. I mean, this is pretty good for a mult 5 if I drop a 5 and find a forest. Because Blight Widow can hold the fort. No, actually, I'm not too worried about that guy. Come on, forest off the top. Oh, and he's missing his land drop. Nope, he's not. Faked it. Well, not much going on, though. This is reasonably good news. Hey, forest, thank you. Alright, we are officially, I think, in decent shape. I mean, he's ahead in cards, but we're going to Blight Sun Zenith at some point. Hopefully not right away. I'd like to draw at least three off of it to get us closer to parity in cards. If he attacks with the Sky Hunter, I'm not blocking. Artillerize kind of sucks here. It's a draw card. Mimic that. He got a mimic that. Was that the same one? Was it a foil mim mimic that? Huh. Yes, it's, it's like here's the non infect draw. Uh, getting a glint hawk under a <laughs> mimic that would be pretty sweet. I actually have no answers to mimic that, so this could be trouble. Sort of. Although, I'm not going to just allow him to get uh, the Glintock I don't want to mimic that. Uh, you know, attacking here does make some sense. Double blocks that leeching bite, but then you can just make perpetual blockers with the mimic fat while drawing cards off of the wellspring. Alright, we don't care too much about that guy. We got the leeching bite. Always nice to uh, play a reader. <laughs> Ooh, that is what we want to see. That's uh, I forgot about this answer for Mimic Fat. That's that. That's good. Oh, and he dropped his warder. He may live to regret that. Go 
go Mult of five. Uh, yeah, I'm just gonna take that. I don't want to shrink my Blight Widow. Because I have Bleaching Bite for it anyway. Too many options, too many options. Overload. Oh, I'm just doing nothing. <laughs> and then I have like Spiremon or Leeching Bite or Blue Sun Zenith open. That's fine. I kind of want to, before I steal, because I, I gotta save the Volition Reigns for the Mimic that. But before I steal it, I want to coax him into. Sitting on some cards. No counters, unfortunately. Yeah, leeching bite. We'll just leeching bite. He gets to put it under the mimic vat. I guess at this point we'll just do the mimic vat. I was, I was, I, think, I don't know if I minute finished saying what I was gonna say. I was trying to like coax him into doing something he shouldn't do unless he has a Mimic Vat, like attack with Glintock to try to get the Iker Wellspring combo going. Alright, so hopefully he's not sitting on a way of dealing with her Volition Reigns. I guess not the end of the world. We are going to draw a bunch of cards at some point. There are many things, as like Revoke Existence would do it. Remember the Fall on Finding the Warder would do it. Oh, or a second Warder would do it, that would do it too. That hurts. Oh, well, we have... Uh, What's it called? Uh, our black removal spell. We also have, we also have bounce. Oh, he's thinking of just getting rid of the mimic vet in general. He's going to target the Mimic Vat. So now I can't kill the, the Relic Warder. If I kill the Relic Warder, he gets Mimic Vat. But it's going to be an empty Mimic Vat, but still. That turns off my Blight Widows. And we'll find uh, another way through. I mean, I'm not too worried about dying to Relic uh, Warder attacks. Okay, so we're just going to opt to draw a million five cards here. I guess when he, if he attacks with the water then we can crack back with Blight Widows if you want. No, oh, that is the other half. Did he side out his insect? <laughs> no, we saw the uh, the two one. Well, we drew a bunch of lands. <laughs> um, less than ideal. All right. Well, drop another blight widow. And we have a spire monitor. Well, I mean, we have 
eight turns before we die to a relic warder. Ooh. Uh, what does that imply? A trick of some sort. What could that be? I'm reading what that is. Yeah, yeah, just do that. I don't want to take too much extra damage. I mean, he can't. He can't have something that just destroys me here, can he? Well, maybe not. Maybe he just. Was... Oh, something. Oh, flame fiend. That's pretty good. That is pretty good. I should have. I should have been able to deduce that one and save one of my blight widows. That's pretty brutal. Especially because we drew only land off our uh, blue sun scene. Well, not only land. How much land do I have left? 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. We have 4 lands left. 3 lands left. Jeez. I think I gotta if he if he attacks with the warder I gotta just give him his mimic vat, which is pretty brutal because he's a flame fiend now. Ah, that was a bad block. I should have I should have been able to figure out flame fiend. Volt charge. That's gonna be bad news. Well, things were looking up. If I'm gonna get outplayed, I'm glad it's by a reader. Oof, that's where did the infect go? Oh my god. Well <laughs> one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, 14, fifteen out of seventeen lands. 